Not only is Google working to integrate gestures into the Android operating system itself by replacing the buttons down here at the bottom, they've also been working to add gestures in a number of their own first party applications. And then today I wanna to show you a new gesture that was added to the YouTube application that lets you skip between the chapters that the video uploader has set up for their own video. So we can go into the YouTube application right now. And as we're playing a video, I've previously shown you various gestures like swiping up to do a full screen on the video. You can do a swipe down to exit. And I'll be including these specific tips in the video description for those who want to check up on the other gestures that have been added to YouTube. But again, one of the latest ones is for those content creators who have gone in and added chapters to their video. You can sometimes see these chapters by the little segments that are presented in the seek bar. So if you are watching a video and you want to automatically skip to the next chapter in that video, instead of double tapping with just a finger or a thumb to skip 10 seconds, we can actually double tap with two fingers and skip an entire chapter. You can see we were on chapter four. We can do a double tap to go back to chapter three a double tap again to go back to chapter two. We're doing a double tap, but we're doing it with two fingers instead of the one. The one finger double tap will skip through a couple of seconds. The two finger double tap in a YouTube video using the YouTube application should initiate a skip forward for an entire chapter. Or if you do it on the left side of the video, it will be a skip backward to the last chapter of the video. Again, this only works for videos where the, develop, where the channel uploader has created their own chapters via the video description. But if you see that with the segments in the seek bar in a YouTube video, then know that you can skip through those chapters by simply doing a double tap gesture using two fingers instead of one. And again, you can go back an entire chapter by doing the same thing, but on the left side of the screen. So that's one of the newest gestures that Google has added to the YouTube application. I'm seeing a number of these have been added to a recent update. So please use the comment section below to let me know what your favorite YouTube gesture is, whether it is the fast forward, the rewind, the swipe up to enter full screen mode, the swipe down to exit full screen mode, or any of the others that have not been mentioned here.